you believe that the white, the so-called white Australia policy will always be a stumbling block? I don't think it's such a stumbling block as people pretend, but that it's important for us, I haven't the slightest doubt. That we should maintain it the way it is? So long as we possibly can, we ought to aim at having a homogeneous population. I don't want to see reproduced in Australia the kind of problem they have in South Africa, or in America, or increasingly in Great Britain. I think we, it's been a very good policy, and it's been of great value to us. And I, uh, most of the criticism of it that I've ever heard doesn't come from these Oriental countries, it comes from wandering Australians. All I ask you to remember, in this country of yours, is that every man, woman and child who even sees you with a passing glimpse as you go by will remember it. Remember it with joy. Remember it in the words of the old 17th century poet who read those famous words, I did but see her passing by, and yet I love her till I die. The time has therefore come when we must present so far as we humanly can, a common front backed by a common power. The free world cannot continue to negotiate from weakness or unpreparedness. With all the goodwill in the world and with the most heartfelt desire to make an end of war, we must be ready to meet it if it comes.